Gino De Campo, whose straight-talking comments have enraged the likes of Ulrika Jonsson recently, has even made the claim that there is no need for French people in the world. He has been accused of sexism, xenophobia and risque humor, but has said he refuses to fall prey to cancel culture. Because I'm Gino and everybody knows me for a long time, I can get away with many things that someone else could not get away with, the This Morning Chef claimed. There is a fine line on television and I think I walk the line, he added. An unconcerned Gino admitted he has come close to being cancelled in the past, but instead of worrying, even gave advice to other celebrities experiencing the same thing. What they should do instead of fighting the cancel culture is the way I do it, I don't care what you've got to say, that's what I think," he told The Sun. Read now, Amanda Owen in tears over family memories after unreal farewell during one episode of This Morning, Gino denied that chicken cordon bleu was originally from France, and claimed he wouldn't have cooked it if it had been. Everybody knows I will never cook a French dish, he declared scornfully. I am going to be honest with you, apart from my friend Fred Sirix, I don't like French people. Too close to Italy. They always think everything they do is the greatest. There is no need for French people in the world. He insisted that he was actually preparing an Italian version of stuffed chicken breast, adding, Now the French call it blah 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 but it's really pollo impanado. One incredulous Twitter user wrote, Just imagine the outrage if, he, said, I don't like Pakistani people, or I don't like African people. He would, rightly, be branded a racist. But it's absolutely okay to say I don't like French people. Sick, others considered Gino's comments to be tongue-in-cheek humor, but it's not just the French that he dislikes. According to comments Hess made, Gino's disdain can sometimes extend to his own children, Luciano, Rocco, and Mia, whom he shares with wife Jessica. Insisting that society and the influence of modern men such as David Beckham has put men under pressure to spend an unreasonable amount of quality time with their offspring, he claimed the approach was not for him. I don't like the children when they're children. I love my girl Mia, she's my princess, but if she says to me would you like to do Lego with me for half an hour? The answer is no, he claimed. I don't want to do children things, coloring, all that CP, glittering, not interested, never been interested, never, ever, ever. He made the incendiary comments during Giovanni Fletcher's podcast, Happy Mom, Happy Baby, adding, I don't have patience for kids. They can come to me and start to talk to me sensibly after about 13. Ulrika Jonsson publicly blasted Gino's attitude in her son column, saying that it was a damaging misogynistic and outdated trope that it is the work of women to entertain and play with children. There are countless dads who engage with their children away from work and actually enjoy it, she hit back. Less offensive but still a little controversial, are the sexual innuendos on this morning for which he is now famed. One caller phoned in to discuss clashing with her partner over food choices, complaining she didn't like a small sausage, only for a cheeky Gino to reply, you want a sausage that you can handle. I'm always going to go for a big sausage because you keep the moisture. However, Holly Willoughby also chimed in, insisting, I quite like a chipolata, 